Hey guys, Prepper Nurse One here. Um, today is Thursday, so it's actually a week since my surgery. And uh, like I say, every day I feel a little bit better. I've uh, been sleeping really, really well, and uh, you know, I haven't been sleeping all day anymore, so that's kind of also a good sign. But uh, I've been sleeping really, really well at night. So, and um, but anyway, um, we. Uh, just waiting now um, they ship the parts out for the connectors in the back so I can connect up that third solar panel um, so that's uh, that's definitely a good thing I'll be real happy to have that connected in as well um, and uh, I uh, trying to get things squared away like I say as far as um, I'm thinking that possibly tomorrow um, I'm not 100% sure if I'm going to do this or not, but um, I may take a ride. When I take the kids in or take Heather in to be with her mom for the weekend, I may take a run over to Burgeon and pick up six, or not six, four more batteries. So um, that would give me eight. That would double up what I have now as far as with the amp hours and stuff like that. So i really thinking I may go that route. I'm not 100% sure yet. I had been thinking too originally but I just with everything and you know I just want to make sure that I'm good to go so I know that having eight batteries total is going to be way better and then if I need to add on down the road then I may do it two at a time and just go from there it basically comes down to you know what kind of storage capacity I have how much I'm bringing in how fast they're filling up and that type of thing so um, I know that on 500 watts the four batteries are filling pretty quickly so um, once this third panel's wired in, which it will be this week, I'm anticipating um, that delivery probably tomorrow. Um, if not tomorrow, then Saturday at the latest. And I will hook in this third solar panel. And um, so, you know, I just want to, you know, make sure that we're, we're good to go. And uh, so if I pick up the, the batteries and get them wired in, and it really won't take much at all to wire them, and I won't over uh, str stress myself doing that. Now, no, I will not be lifting the batteries to take them into the building. I will get somebody else to do that because there's no freaking way I can do that because they're heavier than heavy. So, um, and I'm not even going to take that chance. Um, they'll put them right in the back of my truck for me um, when I pick them up because that's what they did last time. So that part of it's easy. It's just when I get back up here, I'll just have to ask one of the neighbors if they would bring them into the building for me. And that's not, that's not a big deal. Um, it'll take them five minutes but I just I know I can't do it and I'm not even going to attempt to do it so um, but the wiring it up part that's not that's a no-brainer that's going to take no time at all and so that's what's going on with that it's a much much nicer day we had a nice rainstorm this morning um, that came through and it was really coming down for a couple of hours which it was actually refreshing um, right now it's really refreshingly cool um, I think that today's high is only going to be going up to 86 which is much better than 95 that I think we hit yesterday. I'm not sure we hit 95, but um, we were up there. So, um, you know, the humidity is still really high. So um, I'm sure it'll be hot today. But, uh, you know, we're just, uh, we're adjusting. We're settling in. Um, I just got a phone call from uh, my son's school where he's going to be going. Um, and uh, there's a BOCES program in a town called Mount Morris. And so they're going to, um, I'm going to actually go over next Wednesday with Eddie and we're going to check it out. And, uh, you know, so, uh, you know, I go to the doctors on Tuesday and then Wednesday we'll go and we'll check out that program. So, you know, one step at a time, getting things squared away, getting them ready for school. Um, that's the next focus. You know, I mean, it's the whole school clothes, school supplies, all that good stuff. So <laughs> it's, it never stops. It's always something else, but, uh, you know, we're, uh, we're moving along in the right direction. Um, like I said, my next focus, as I'm feeling better here, probably the first part of the next week, um, after I get to the doctors, I should say, I'm really going to start focus on getting a building in here. Um, have I done a little research? Yes. Have I done a lot? No, I have not. Um, I've just been really focusing on trying to feel better. Um, you know, making videos every day for you guys. You know, that, that part is easy. But then it's like, you know, it's, I've been, I get, I get tired real easy right now. So, um, but like I said, it's all coming together and it will, and uh, I have no doubt. And, uh, you know, I'm a good healer. I always have been. So 
we're just doing it day by day at this point. And as I get better and as I get stronger, and you know, like I said, I'm not going to overdo it. I'm not going to lift too soon. Um, you know, the plastic surgeon said a month, so I'm not lifting squat for at least a month. And then I'm basically going to go by what my body feels like, to be honest with you. Um, and we're just going to go from there. And uh, but I could be out of work four to six weeks. You know, I mean, it really, I want to go back when I'm ready. I don't want to go back too early and end up hurting myself. I mean, that's just, that would be stupid um, to go through all this, hurt myself, and then it would put me further behind, and I, I don't want to do that. So um, I'm just going to listen to the doctors and uh, see what they say and uh, listen to my body. That's a big key, too. And um, we're just going to go day by day. So um, I'm going to cut this short. I don't even know how far we are into this video already. But uh, things are coming along. We're just kind of chilling out right now. And, uh, you know, hopefully, like I said, I get this next connector tomorrow and I'll uh, I get this next thing connected in and then we'll be up to 750 watts. Um, once I get my credit for the 100 watt solar panel, um, I am going to be buying another 250 watt panel. So I will have a grand total of 1,000 watts. And then at that point, I'm going to really see what we're looking at and kind of go from there. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Prepper Nurse 105.